Hey, check this out. We got Illuminati cards here. Look, it's card number 30333. Okay. Um, check this out right here. Illuminati cards. Gremlin Air Magic Fake Artifact. Cl Air Magic Clamor Jammer. That's me right there. Check that out. It's tight. I'm right up in the search. Neat. Uh, anyway, Gremlins. Let me see if I can find the card, a picture of it. Okay. But check this out while we're sitting here while waiting for that to load. This is called A View from Space. And it shows a, a worm coming through its TV at the guy. And it's kind of funny that I think they call computer viruses worms too. Uh, but uh, basically, lately, they can look at you from freaking space uh, pretty easily now with the persistent uh, surveillance initiative with satellites, with Google satellites. But this was the other card I was going to look at here, because check this out. On Gremlins, he is smashing up a computer, okay? And I have seen a lot of uh, conspiracy people will have their videos cut out from, from under them, have calls dropped, the, the sound get all messed up. I mean, they get more uh, sabotage from, like, uh, some, from psychic... Uh, astral projectors and psychic vampires and uh, all these spies and shit, these men who stare at goats types, who can really sick gremlins on your computer stuff in all actuality, and then you got computer, let's see, computer virus, and same thing here, look, your computer, it looks like the computer's melting, and then it says think, but it's spelled F-T-H-I-M-K. Really scary. Uh, look, but the computer's melting from a virus. Then, here's the other one. Let me see. Illuminati cards. Hackers. So, basically, hacker's card is basically like... Where the frick is it at? Okay, I guess I'm going to have to go to the Goob. Let's go to the Goob to get it, huh? Okay. Goob. Okay, so hackers here. Um, okay, check it out. You got this dude. Looking all, uh, oh, and then there's like a, uh, a freaked out one right here, too. Let's see, come on. Yeah, this dang autofocus blows. Um, anyway, this is a guy on the computer. It's basically like, it foretells, like, look, this card was used in the movie The Matrix. Hackers, right? Um, uh, Neo was a hacker. And, uh... Basically, he became like a living virus to the uh, Matrix, which is the computer uh, hive mind uh, Skynet type of uh, thing. Let me see. And this card was also in the Matrix. Which, not a lot of people know about this. Uh, look, phone freakers. And look at this. See this, Pink Boy, you're next? This also shows like how the military... Was going to let gays in. Pink boy, you're going to get drafted. Anyway, uh, freaking the madness. But phone, there's a phone freakers card. And the phone freakers was in the Matrix. That's how they uploaded in and out of the Matrix to the real world. That's all crazy. But look, anyway, hackers is like anonymous. They always blame stuff that goes on on hackers when it's really just them hiring people to sabotage their own system so they can pass more legislation to kick us out of it. And you can look how the FBI will hire uh, hackers and, and people who can break alarm systems or crack safes. They'll hire the criminals to crack their own shit just to see how it's done and see how they can defend against it. So if they hire hackers from the inside out. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's messed up too, that phone freaks. Here we go. An infrasound, man. Uh, I think phone freaking has something to do with infrasound. It was these guys who could pick up a phone and just go... 
and they could they could access some kind of code by doing tones and frequencies, and they could actually uh, tap into some kind of uh, system. There it is, phone freaks, phone freaks. Come on, you funker. What's this other one? Mutual betrayal. <laughs> Yeah, I guess that's what happened to uh, that Caesar guy. Everyone stabbed. There it is. Phone freaks. So, I think these cards are are all are the corporate masters. That's corporatism. That's fascism. Um. So yeah, it's Frank and food is a card, and I hear people say that too, dude. Wow. Um. Go fish. There was just something about sharks the other day. There's been a lot of shark stuff, but. You know what? Maybe, do you remember that movie with LL Cool J where the shark had human uh, genes in it and they were uh, using them as weapons? And I heard that they had uh, spy dolphins too. Like uh, uh, like some government actually did make spy dolphins that were genetically modified and hybrid, hybridized. Um, quite crazy. But yeah, man, it's, it was all set up, dude. It was. It's like on the game, once again... Uh, a view from space on the game, the newer Grand Theft Auto, the Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, the one for 360. Every person, when you switch from person, it's like you, there's a view from space that shoots all the way down to you like you're being watched by aliens. And they keep throwing that out in the game kind of like we're in a big alien, like ant, an ant uh, aquarium basically, uh, which is quite crazy. But, uh, yeah, what was it? Uh, and, uh, I don't know, I forgot what, why that was important, but, uh, uh, yeah, I will continue on later, uh, I just lost my brain. Oh, yeah, uh, G Gremlins, Hackers, Hackers is Anonymous, Viruses, oh, yeah, on the game, it shows you where you go and you, like, basically plan a uh, explosive device in this in the in the maker of this this phone the smartphone app that everyone's addicted to and once you play the app it has these pop-up porn ads the more that you use them they actually blow your computer up so that's part of the virus mountain card and it's sicking the gremlins on you because these pop-ups will pop up and they are very good with the flicker rate and all their other technology to get you to click on stuff or get you distracted with the woman in the red dress, woman in the red dress. 